No more newbie here, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a YouTube profile picture in ShareFactory and how to upload it onto your YouTube channel. If you're a PS4 player and want to learn how to make awesome gaming videos using ShareFactory plus learn how to do more on YouTube and other PS4 related stuff then this is the channel for you so please subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on future videos like this. Okay so we're in ShareFactory and we want to find some images that we want to use so we can either use screenshots or we can use a theme like this one where we've got a theme background and text over the top that we've added or if you want to you can import some images so you could check out my other videos which is how to import images no USB and how to import images with USB and uh, they're in the playlist so do check those out if you want specific images but the way to do it is to go into um, my into photos and then into new project and then you just choose which screenshot or image you want so I'm going to give you a couple of examples and later on I'm going to show you how to upload it onto your YouTube channel so I'm going to choose this one to start with so you just select it and push square and then you can rename it if you want to but for this example we're not going to and then what you can do is just um, edit the background so we can push cross and then we can go into pan and zoom and then we just find the image that we want so this one is just going to be a Fortnite profile headshot and what you need to do is try and get the image that you want roughly this this sort of distance away um, it'll become clearer in a minute what, what I'll do is I'll show you a way of working out what it would look like now obviously the profile picture in YouTube is circular so I'm going to just choose one of these stickers here and put it on to the uh, screenshot and if we change the opacity it means that we can see through it so it gives us a real good idea of what the profile picture will look like now you don't actually need this sticker it's just to use it as an example of what it would look like as a profile so I've made that as big as it can go and then we just move it around until you get it roughly where you'd want it and if you're happy with that then you can get rid of the sticker and then when you save the image and then you upload it to um, YouTube then you'll be able to have an idea this is what it's going to look like when it's on the profile picture so if you push options once you're happy and you export to gallery then that will save it okay and then that will be ready for us to do the next step okay so I'll show you that again with another image so you can also use photos if you want to so this is an image that was an actual photo but it was imported onto share factory and do check out the other videos for that if you want to do it do exactly what we've just done now you can change it to a PNG or JPEG so I'd suggest having it as a JPEG setting uh, forgive me I should have said that on the first one as well so you can change it but again export it to uh, gallery and then you can save your project and exit okay so then you can go across to my gallery and just check that your images are there and once you're happy with that you can grab your USB stick or memory stick and put it into your PS4 so that we can upload the images to your USB stick and then once we've completed this next bit we will use the USB stick in your PC or laptop to upload it when we're on the YouTube channel so what we should do first is just go into the main menu on the uh, PS4 so main menu and then you go into capture gallery okay once you've gone into capture gallery you can click on share factory and then you can find the images that you've um, you want to put onto your profile so I'm going to add the ones here so what you can do is just click on the one you want and copy to USB storage device now I won't be able to show you the next step because I'm sure using the USB device to record this for you um, but it's very straightforward after that it just tells you which folders it's going to be on your USB stick then you go into YouTube and you go into your channel and then you can hover over your existing profile picture if you have one already and then just click on it and it will show you each step what to do so we can go to upload photo and you can see there that's the image that I was playing about with there which is purely a, a share factory screenshot with some text over the top okay so then we can go into the image and this box will show you what it will look like so you can drag it left and right you can't move it up and down but you can resize the box by using clicking on the top corners any of the top corners and you can drag it in 
a little bit okay so you can play about to get that exactly how you want it now you've got to remember that that circle uh, or the square that you're looking at changes to a circle so I would make the box a little bit bigger to start with and you can always come back into it and reduce it if you need to okay you can also rotate it uh, why you'd want to do that I don't know but um, it's always an option and then you click done once you're happy and then we can see what it looks like now you can see there's a line across the top and that's where when I rotated it it moved it back so we could just got to resize it again and get that roughly how we think we're going to want it now I've actually left the sticker outline on the back here so you can do that if you want to or you can leave it so the other ones I took it off this one I've left it on it doesn't make much difference because it's kind of uh, out of it as well you don't really notice it and then you just confirm what you've done and it doesn't update straight away but what you can do if you want to is you can just refresh the page and you'll notice that the profile picture changes from that what it is now to the new image there and that is as easy as it gets okay I'm going to show you what the other ones look like as well um, just so you can have an idea of what it looks like so that's the Fortnite image that we've done exactly the same process and really straightforward I think Okay, so we're on to shout out of the day and this goes to two people who suggested the idea of this video. So thank you for the suggestion. Um, please go and check out Ollie JD and Ace Bernardo who both suggested this video. Uh, do check out their content and if you like what they're doing, please consider subscribing. So that is it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you found it useful, please give us a like. If you haven't yet subscribed and you've got to the end, I'm presuming you've liked the video. So please Please do subscribe and turn on notifications we have lots more share factory videos coming plus other YouTube related and PS4 related videos so thanks very much and bye